listen up because this is a gift for the Ridiculously Human podcast, which not only means Gareth and Craig, also means you who are listening. All right, so check it out. Here's my first gift right here. It's in rhyme form. I'm always into this music. I'm being intervived by Ridiculously Human. Gareth and Craig about to interview me, your friend Tony Mosey. Yes, yours truly. Two South African men who make spectacular friends. The podcast season is the reason why I'm rapping for them. Oh, I love it. That is flipping cool, man. Thank you so much. Buddy. Metal detectors because yeah. kids at the mm. age of 12 and 13 were bringing knives and guns. Great drugs and you have to worry about gangs and i was worried i couldn't even i couldn't even concentrate i mean i could not concentrate because kids were always you know they were picking on me they were you know jumping me always in groups uh i mean i would try to be in class trying to concentrate and kids would always try to throw big things at me kick me you know i, I the one i remember the one thing that was always vividly was when i would get picked up uh by the you know the school bus and I would go into the bus and I'd be treated like Forrest Gump, like the movie Forrest Gump. I would get into the bus and just when I want to make a seat, I want to sit down, a kid would move over and be like, sorry, there's no, wow. there's, there's no room here. And then I'd move to the next one. They'd be like, they're like, oh, no, man. you're not sitting here. But one kid, he messaged me on Instagram one day. He was really depressed, super, super depressed. And he was ghost following me on Instagram for a whole year, never messaged me. He goes, I wanted to kill myself like sometime before that he goes i was really depressed my mom they get on me and all stuff like that my mom and dad they're always on me they make me really ang anxious really stressed out because because i was able to tell my story and so much with transparency being so vulnerable being so open and clear about who i am that one kid stopped himself from wanting to kill himself like, wow. if we can tweak our mindsets put ourselves in a different situation feed our minds with more uh helpful things you know positive things uh, we can we can make for at least our better lot we could better our lives at least individually and that's where mm. it needs to start it needs to start from within first before we can go without before we can reach thousands and millions and billions of people we have to start first from within and many people need to see that concept <laughs>